Now onto the forecasting process. What is your current process? How does that work and who is involved? Yeah, I love forecasting. So forecasting is only as good as the people who put the data in the, the system. So we do a, a couple, yeah, we do a couple ways to do it. So we have one of the back end that we um, analyze the data using a scored methodology, like we score everything on how far the, the deals are going down the pipeline, how much time in between each stage, um, who's on the deal from a contact standpoint, how engaged are they? All that stuff goes into kind of in the background. Um, but as far as how it's run, we have our, what we call segment sales operations managers. Um, we have the sales managers and then we have kind of finance um, that's in there. And we usually do um, bi-weekly calls, but we kind of push it out to monthly because things are moving a little bit slower uh, recently. So what they do is they get on the line after the sales manager has set their forecast within our sales force. It's pretty standard. You have your commit, you have your upside, you have your pipeline there. Um, and we try to project out for the next quarter. Uh, so we say, we go through where you're at this quarter and then where you're projecting next quarter. And then if we have time, we'll go into um, what we can provide the following quarter that we may be able to pull into this quarter to um, help out if they're behind on deals. Uh, we also go through um, sort of, uh, if they've given us some type of commit number, we kind of push on that number a little bit to say, okay, well, based on what we see um, in the pipeline, nothing has moved. And that's where I say it's about as good as the data they put in it, right? So that's where we get a lot of our context. What makes ours a little bit different, though, than I feel other companies is that the segment sales operations leader on our team have had experience in sales, and they also work some of those deals that these guys are forecasting on or have. Um, and by that, from usually from a technical standpoint, so they can generally call out um, some erroneous data very quickly, um, which helps us quite a bit on our, on our uh, forecasting process. 